What's up YouTube? I'm Brad from Rancher Us. As always guys, if y'all enjoy our content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. We're on the road to 1000. We hope you guys will help us get there. Alright, so Season 3 of Mayans MC is upon us, or almost upon us. It's a little less than a month away as of this video. So today we're going to be doing a trailer reaction uh, for the first uh, trailer that's come out. Uh, of course, you know, we had this, uh, we had the teaser trailer uh, that he don't answer us. We did do a, a quick little video over it, but of course, you know, it didn't show very much uh, in regards to what is going to be taking place in season three. So hopefully this trailer will ask, at least answer some of our questions, maybe give us a hint as to the SOA member that got killed at the end of season two. Maybe give us a clue as to why Taz did what he did at the end of Season 2 by killing a fellow member of Mayans MC. So, uh, you know, there's going to be a lot of little things. Maybe telling, you know, this relationship between Galindo and Emily. Like, is she going to be playing a bigger role in the cartel? Or is she going to be kind of like a backseat now? Uh, like, like, is it going to be all about... You know, Galindo and what he's going to do moving forward. Is he finally going to take the leap forward in, with Alvarez's help in being the the villain that really Mayans MC have been missing all this time? So hopefully some of those questions will be answered. Um, but let's just go ahead and get into the trailer. This plan, if this fails... Our brothers are going to be gunning for you. I swing big, miss big. I've never been afraid of swing. Yeah. I figured you'd say that. All right. So my take on just that is it looks like Angel and Easy are going to be kind of going outside of Mayans um, and maybe going disregarding the orders of bishop and you know the you know mayans mc as a whole about what they're going to do when it comes to maybe adelita and potter something along those lines uh but it looks like they're going to be kind of playing on the outside of not just the law but of their own um uh, uh gang like so that's going to be kind of cool if they do that I've been waiting for these brothers to finally come together and maybe do something that's just out of the ordinary, something that, um, you know, kind of mixes this show up a little bit. And it looks like we're finally going to get that in season three where that, you know, hey, you know what, these guys, they're going to risk it all. There's going to be some high stakes in what they're doing now. So, like, I'm excited about that. I, I hope that's the, I hope. That's what I'm reading into it, and I hope that's actually correct. Back, impossible. God help us all. Border shut down. You got any idea how much pressure we're under right now? Actions have consequences. Take away power. Take away the crown. One king. Okay. Okay. Now this is kind of actually interesting. Um, you know, this taking place, you know, because the gavel is involved in this. Um, Diem saying, you know, take away the power. One king. Things along those lines. Are they going to maybe try to prop Bishop up as like the head of head when it comes to uh, to, the, to Mayans? Or or does that mean something else? I, I don't see what else it could mean. Because, uh, you know, they're obviously not talking about, talking about Galindo. I don't think in that situation. Uh, but something's going on. You know, you can see it on Taz's face that he's not necessarily uh, uh, in favor of this. Uh, but something big is going to happen within Mayans as a whole, um, and it and you can see it on their face again. This this just so far seems like really high stakes. I'm glad that they're doing this. They're taking chances. This is like the Kurtz the 
post Kurt Sutter error, and it looks like uh, it's going going in the right direction. This isn't gonna end well for your brother. I hate your brother. Ooh, Coco is. Uh, Coco looks like he's going off the deep end. Oh, that guy. I am. Uh, I forget what is his name, Mendez or something along those lines. I actually figured he was the one that actually died. I thought he was going to be the Sons of Anarchy member that that Mayans killed at the end of season two. So it looks like he's still alive. Run, move. Could start a war. At least he was. Well, you should be more <laughs> careful, easy days. You, you think that you can survive without our pipeline? Without Sano Padre? Let me see you try it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So it is going to be something about... There's going to be this civil war within Mayans that, that's going to be taking place. So it really was about uh, maybe propping Bishop up as a head. Or maybe even, who knows, Alvarez. You know, you know, there's a part of me that still believes that Alvarez is still Mayans through and through. I don't believe that he's... Uh, you know, if it came down to it, I don't believe that he would uh, take Galindo's side. Like, if there was a war between Galindo and uh, Mayans MC, I just don't believe he would uh, abandon them like that. So, I'm almost kind of wondering, okay, are they going to prop Bishop up as a head? Or maybe is it Alvarez that's coming back? Like, I would, I'm just kind of curious about that as to what is going to happen uh, when it comes to that overall, I thought the trailer was excellent um, You know it did answer some of the questions um, You know, there's one possibility or one person that uh, You know that was Could have been the person at the end of season two that got killed that they did show in this trailer um, That you know now he can be completely and totally ruled out. Uh, I don't believe it was happy Though I don't, I don't remember seeing Happy in this video. So, and I mean, you know, I don't know who else it could be. Like, I really don't. I mean, is I don't think it's going to be somebody. Um, I don't think it's going to be somebody from, you know, Sons of Anarchy that we knew. Like, I don't think it's going to be Chibs or Tig or any of those characters. At least I hope it's not that. Surely they're going to bring Chibs uh, back for season three. Um, because he's going to play an instrumental role in what's going to take place uh, during season three. So I would be really shocked if, you know, it was Chips. But at this point, I'm like, if they just killed like some random person that we don't really know or care about at the same time, like that'll just be kind of a, you know, a waste of a, uh, well, a, a, a cliffhanger, basically. I mean, kept a 16... Uh, months waiting to find out exactly who it was just for it to be a nobody like that would kind of suck but then I guess at the same time it would be still it's still a Sons of Anarchy member so either way you know they're gonna be facing some serious uh, consequences but overall I'm really excited about this um, I'm glad that Easy has finally got a love interest interest away from Emily um, I feel like she bogged down his character way too much. Just kind of like I felt like Tara bogged down Jax's character in the original Sons of Anarchy. So, I mean, there is, um, there's some good things that's going on in this. I think, you know, this whole where Angel and Easy are going off on their own and, you know, maybe going against the cartel, maybe going against Potter, maybe going against, uh, even Mayans. Um, you know, in order to maybe save Adelita, you know, that's a big thing. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to this season. I mean, I thought this trailer was awesome. Uh, loved every minute of it. I cannot wait until the season comes out. And we're here on Rants or Us. We're going to do episode by episode, episode uh, reviews weekly. Uh, so stay tuned for that. And guys, so if y'all enjoy uh, Mayans MC prepared to get a lot of it in the next coming months because we're gonna like i said we're gonna hit this hard 
and uh, because this is one of our this is Lance and I's one of our favorite shows on television. So um, so yeah, guys, stay tuned for more Mayans MC uh, videos to come. And as always, guys, thank y'all so much for watching.